So the mistake number one, as I talked about, is about addressing, not addressing the whole animal. And I've got this, I've got my board here. And may, this might seem like a little silly <laughs> cat. This is not my best rendition of a drawing. I'm not an artist. But, you know, if we have an animal here, and it's not just the physical. It's we have all the four parts together affect each other. Together they create synergy. So we need to look at the whole picture because the wellness is the sum of all those aspects. And what I'm seeing more and more is we're, we're looking at the physical only. We continue to look at the physical, but what I want you to, what we wanna do is say, the physical is the foundational piece. So your physical is a foundational piece, but if we're having, we have an emotional or a, a spiritual issue or a mindset issue, which is mental, which is like worry, then what's going to happen is that those areas are also going to affect us. So the other way you could look at this, which is an easy metaphor, is a stool. If you have a stool and we took away one of the legs, it has four legs, we took away one of the legs, well, it probably could still kind of work. Well, if you took away two legs, how would that stool work? Maybe you're balancing on two, right? But if you took away three legs of that stool, it, there's no way it would function. So that's how I want you to start looking at even yourself and your animal. Okay, the great thing about oils, let's talk about an, an essential oil, is that one of the reasons I love to use them besides the fact that they really can affect the limbic system because your sense of smell, right? When you smell something, it goes directly to your limbic system, which, which is meaning where's your seat of the emotions are, are stored, your emotions and your mind. Okay, so you can shift the patterning or your animal can shift the patterning right away. But the great thing is about those oils is they address all four of those aspects. So let me give you, um, let me give you a, um, an example of that. We're using peppermint oil. So physically, peppermint oil is, helps to support the digestive and the respiratory system. Emotionally, it's going to cool those emotions and then release your fear, especially with motion. Um, it also helps resistance to learning. That's why I asked everybody to do that at the beginning, use it at the beginning of the class here today. Mm -hmm.